Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Sunday here. Uh, tropical update time. Things are heating up a little bit. We have a few little spots out there on the NHC map. Everybody's uh, getting a little, little anxious here as we enter September this week in Labor Day. Um, new update just came out at 8 o'clock this morning. And really the only thing to watch it now is this one right here. This is Invest 91. I got all the spaghetti models uh, posted on the website and the app. Um, it just got bumped up to red 70%. So, yeah, you know, we're going to be watching this one. Um, the other little guy down here is still hanging on at 20, 20, and 10. This, uh, this is the Invest 92 popped up last night. Let's take a look at the big picture real quick. Uh, not sure uh, influence-wise what it's going to do, but uh, this is 91. This is 92. Uh, and then we got, you know, low chance here. The GFS has been showing. And then, of course, this is definitely down the road stuff but uh, this is 91 this is what we're going to focus on and we'll see um you know long range steering currents are always hard to uh, pinpoint and uh the main the main thing that we're watching right now is the fact that we do have a general motion west northwest uh here's the latest that just came out these are your southwest florida water management sites and uh, we of course have tropical tidbits also the euro is this orange line here and it's actually uh you know trended a little bit more towards the bahamas and uh florida so uh, you know it's so early in the game to get too worked up on anything except we know tropics september anything in the western atlantic needs to be watched close um so we will be it's nearing um late like i said it's nearing labor day weekend some of your latest models let me show you real quick so i have to show you the gfs as you know we've been talking about the gfs all season long gfs has been uh horrendous terrible <laughs> it's been spitting out hurricanes left and right but I, I do need to show it's been very consistent on this one coming up here through the uh caribbean this is tropical tidbits by the way dot com uh so i got to put it out there it's really the only model showing it uh even some of the gfs ensembles aren't showing much down there but just keep one eye open on it you know uh western gulf of mexico it's the only model showing it uh, but it is starting to show the same little spot here. This is uh, next Monday. This is Labor Day. This is a GFS. Let's zoom in a little closer here. Um, so the GFS is showing that. The latest Euro uh, is showing a little bit more movement towards um, Florida here. Now, the interesting thing to note on this is uh, a weaker system, uh, you know, showing up. The uh, It's all going to come down to upper level steering currents. Uh, that, you know, 10 days out, like I mentioned, is very hard to um, predict uh, any of that this far out but you know yesterday we were showing a, a, a strong high pressure system that was brewing here and, and overnight models aren't really showing it so it's just really hard to predict long-range steering currents right now maybe within a week we can see that but as far as uh, the latest euro you know low pressure anytime you get a low pressure you got to watch it i mean at this point you're just looking at little seeds you know uh and you know don't really focus on intensity right now we just know Things can happen fast. Um, but there's the latest Euro showing this timing here is next Monday, Labor Day. Keep an eye on that. The uh, latest Canadian model showing, uh, again, another system. And, you know, it kind of gets it going. Then we have a recurve possibly showing. Uh, the latest icon is almost similar. Uh, so there you go. Um, again, very low confidence in the Gulf just take note the gfs keeps showing it uh but as far as the other four models that we use that i use a lot icon euro cmc and gfs are all showing something nearing the bahamas and maybe the southeast uh too far to be certain but definitely want to keep an eye on the tropics this week as we uh enter into labor day weekend so hey don't get wrapped up in in, in individual model runs this far out just be aware you know hey we got something cooking um you're going to see a lot of windshield wiping effects. You're going to see some maybe go more towards the southeast Florida than the next run. You might see one curve up to the Atlantic. You know, this windshield wiper flip-flopping around is normal. Just the general, you know, motion that we're looking at is west-northwest. Um, and like I said, we have, uh, I got all the Levi's stuff here on the site. You can take a look at it. These get updated every six hours. So you can stay glued to the spaghetti models uh, if you want. And the NAC just bumped it up to... Um, 70%. So definitely something to watch here in uh, the week ahead. So I'll be on it. We'll be on the Daily Brew every day, maybe every night. 
tomorrow for sure, uh, Monday morning, maybe one tonight. We'll see. Maybe uh, we'll we'll surprise everybody tonight with a, a live update. Maybe around five o'clock. Five o'clock somewhere. All right. Have a great Sunday. Cheers. Bye bye.